Hey Gus. Gus. Say say hi Gus. Yeah. He says hi. Hi. I'm Sam. From the Cincinnati area. I'm not gonna get specific because I don't trust the internet very much. That was kind of a stupid sounding thing. But um I need uh this is a skate support video and I need a bit of help with my front side 180s. Just they're not working for me. Mr. Aaron Cairo, if you could help me out with my front side 180 needs, you might come into a bit of pocket change. Alright, so uh, obviously I can ride my boards somewhat easily. I mean, not somewhat. I can ride my board easily. So, uh, I never realized how hard it would be to get a steady video while riding, so uh, sorry it's so shaky, but, uh, yeah, I get, I get another perspective on the ground, and that's gonna come up in a second, yeah, so there you go. If you saw me, like, if you saw me, like, fall back really quickly, I wasn't losing my balance, I was trying to get over like a large crack there without just making a large bump or something so uh, yeah here uh, I have some ollies there you go got some nice pop on it and yep yeah, here's another pretty decent one if I do say so myself yep yeah. yep yeah. right, uh, here's my front side 180 attempts Thanks. Uh. Alright, so uh, if you don't mind, I like to try and talk while I'm attempting these two and try and figure out what I'm doing wrong along with you. I don't know, I just, I don't know, I just like to do it. So, uh, yeah, here's my first attempt. And that was obviously just a lack of effort. And yeah, I don't know, I don't know why I included that one, but whatever. It's just one of the things that happens in here. I actually had a pretty decent one. I think the only thing I did wrong was I was leaning just slightly back and I didn't get my back foot up. Um, yeah. That one. That one just went all over. Oh, yeah. And really quick, I didn't want to lift my shirt up because, like, I'm trying to be a tool or anything. I, my face was just really sweaty, so I had to wipe it off. So don't get the wrong idea. And there. Back foot and I was leaning so it kind of shot out here I'm not sure what happened everything was good and then I guess like a vacuum just appeared like out of the view of the camera and just sucked my board out so I'm not really sure what happened there uh, here uh, I guess just not enough turning and my back foot stayed too close to the ground uh, Again, back foot. I guess that's a reoccurring problem here. Back foot, not turning enough. It looked like I was leaning too far forward on that one, actually. Thanks for watching this, and please get back to me. Hey man, so thanks a ton for sending in your video and putting so much work into it. I really appreciate it. Cool, so let's help you out with your front side 180s here. Yeah, like you said, it is a recurring problem of coming off with your back foot. And let's see what happens on this one. Straight. See, it looks like you're on there, and you are actually on there, but then your back foot just comes off. This is what I call, like, kind of a safety or a safe way out. Um, a lot of beginner, newer skaters always do that as kind of a practice step. But at a certain point, you got to kind of get over that practice step and just go... That's it. And sometimes it does take a lot and it does take like reinforcement. Sometimes it even takes your friends being there saying, you're not giving up. You have to land this. Like you have no idea what we go through to make Lance do some of the things that he does. Um, if he was skating outside in his garage alone, he would probably have just given up. Not that he couldn't do it alone, but it just sometimes helps to have people to push you 
and I just want to give you that viewpoint so you understand that you do have to like fully commit and fully just go for it. Um, the other thing, the main thing that I think, and the thing that's usually out on this, is your head and shoulders aren't turning. And it's very tricky because, well, first of all, I couldn't see your head and shoulders in the video. But second of all, you never think about your head and shoulders. When you're skateboarding, you think about what your feet and your legs are doing and what your board is doing, and that's it. But especially with 180 tricks, it's usually something's out with your head. And I mean, in terms of how you turn your head and how you're turning your shoulders, it looks like you're not turning your head and shoulders fully because it looks like you're, something's preventing your legs from going around all the way. And that's part of the reason why your back foot is coming off, I do believe. It might also just be, like I said, like a practice step or a safety thing. But you are very, 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 very close. So just tell yourself, I'm not going to go back inside until I do a front side 180. Make sure you turn your head and shoulders and then take it down. Definitely get Skateboarding Made Simple. There are five different volumes. All of them are available on iTunes as iBooks and at BrailleSkateboarding.com. So definitely check them out. You guys will not be disappointed. Thanks again for your help and support. You guys are the best.